Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a small Dollarama haul to show you. Um, so this is over the course of a couple visits to Dollarama uh, and the different locations as well. Uh, so I decided to combine everything. Um, so the first thing I had picked up is a pack of these um, spring toys um, for $1.50. Um, I believe Anne Makes uh, here on YouTube uh, was talking about these, saying that she couldn't find them. I couldn't find these either uh, for a while, and Sophia absolutely loves these um, springy toys. Um, we have so many of these around the house already. Um, I At least once a week I go around the, uh, the house uh, or home trying to retrieve <laughs> these uh, springy toys. They get underneath the couch, they get underneath the uh, refrigerator and, and whatnot, but I always like to have one pack on hand. Um, yeah, she absolutely loves these. She, she actually plays fetch with these. Um, yeah, so um, I picked up one pack of those. I was happy to see those again. Um, <clears throat> I picked up the one pack of these uh, decorative wooden shapes of these flowers uh, for a dollar twenty-five. Um, these are great to alter. Uh, I may even keep them as is. I actually do like them as is um, to include in in projects. I don't know how many there are in here, uh, but uh, I thought these were really pretty. Again, a dollar twenty-five, and these are this is a repeat buy for me. I've showed um, these before. Um, I bought more of the cat head bamboo and uh, bamboo shape. It's a. Um, I'm going to alter these, so I ended up getting three. I already had one on hand, which I hauled before. Uh, I just bought an extra one in case I goof up on one. Um, Next, um, I'm pretty sure a lot of you fellow crafters here in Canada have seen these and ha have probably picked these up. These have been at Dollarama for, for a while now. I already opened these up just to look them over and uh, I already took out a couple pages to use in my fragrance scrapbook um, journal slash journal um, binder. Um, I picked up this pack of designer papers, um, comes with 12 sheets, these are 6x6 um, papers, uh, these are of all the fruits, so you got lemons, pineapples, bananas, um, strawberries, I don't even, I don't know what that is. I think this is supposed to be kiwi, but I'm not sure. But anyways, um, I figure um, I could uh, include these um, in my book. I don't have anything like this in my collection um, to to include. So these were a dollar twenty-five. Um, so that's why I picked those up. And the next one is like a nautical theme. Um, great for some of my summer uh, fragrances that I pick up from Bath and Body Works and so forth. Um, again, a dollar twenty-five comes with twelve sheets, and I'm pretty sure a lot of you have already seen these. So I'm not going to show you guys, but these are the papers that come in this pack. And I also picked up two more packs of the Studio sheet protectors. Uh, for a dollar twenty-five, uh, they're for my um, scrapbook. And lastly, from a Bath and uh, Bath and Body Works. <laughs> lastly, from Dollarama, I had picked up a pack of these um, roll-on um, roller ball perfumes. Um, sorry about the glare. They're by Revlon. I've already taken them out of the package. And I'm just going to show you guys how they look like. Um, so this is the first one called Rain On. 
Uh, and the set notes for Rain On is, uh, or the description is, um, take on the world with this clean floral scent of rain kiss petals. Um, so I picked up, so that's the first one in there. They're similar to the ones that are, that you find at Bath and Body Works. I, I call them flankers. Um, I'm not sure if that is the appropriate, um, or proper, um, definitions uh, of these little perfume bottles. But again, I call them flankers. Um, and this next one is called One Heart. Uh, the notes to this one is, um, or the description is embrace love for all with this floral musky scent that envelops you in the warmth of a cashmere blanket. So that's one heart. And the last one, um, in the, uh, collection here in this box, this one's called All In. Um, and the description for this is ignite your passions with this fruity woody scent of ruby fruits and warm vanilla. Now I tried all three and they're not bad actually. Um, these were I believe four dollars um, and I had seen Tina Epp pick these up uh, in a haul, one of her haul videos. Um, and I actually seen these uh, at my store, at my local store, quite a while ago. And um, I figured I'd give them a go. Um, they're not bad, actually. Um, I mean, for $4, why not? Um, I figure I could put these in, one of these in my purse, or I can layer these with uh, some of my Bath & Body Works. Um, so, but yeah, um, and uh, in the package there was a sheet of um, silver um, paper. So I, I will reuse this in crafting. So I picked that up, so I've kept that. The box I will just toss. Um, I have to admit, guys, these were really hard to take out of the package. I struggled quite a bit. Um, but, um, again, uh, they were by Revlon, um, and I believe they were for $4. Um, yeah, so I, I've, I like looking in their, uh, makeup section once in a while. You never know what will pop up there. And, uh, Dollarama has been carrying a lot of Aveeno products, which I absolutely love, uh, more and more, and, um, on a much... Less expensive price um, in comparison to, let's say, Shoppers Rick Mart uh, or Walmart. So, um, yeah, check out your Dollarama because you don't know what will turn up there. Anyways, that is my haul. And I hope everybody's doing well. Um, oh, yes. Um, I just want to show you guys how these look like, actually. I'm just going to unscrew one of these. So, yes, it's a roller ball, as you can see. Um, so, and they're quite, they're quite strong. So, um, but anyways, um, yeah, that is my haul. Um, hope everybody's doing well. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to make a comment down below. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye now.